Hey MB crew, I'm gonna be here. So before we get into the video, make sure you guys turn on your post notifications so you're notified whenever I post a new video on my channel. Make sure you guys are subscribed to my vlog channel, which is always linked in the description box below, and it is Life as Mona B, where I share the behind the scenes of my life. And I'm actually gonna be going out today. So if you guys wanna see me rock this hair out and about, make sure you guys go and subscribe to the vlog channel and check out the videos. And make sure you guys are following me on Instagram at Mona X Banks. So today I'm bringing y'all another another wig um it is a curly unit which i absolutely love it's so pretty so pretty so you guys know i try to bring you guys like more affordable options and things of that nature unit that i am rocking is from my quality here i have worked with them in the past so if you guys are interested in checking out those videos i will link them in the description box below they do sell quality wigs at a very affordable price very affordable price so the unit that i have on my hair today is afro kinky curly wig it is in a texture indian remy hair is in a natural color it is 14 inches 150 density it has a six inch lace frontal medium lace color and a cap size small so they do offer this in different limbs different cap sizes and things of that nature now i believe this is my first time getting like afro kinky and indian remy and i definitely can tell a difference in the hair in my opinion it's way more defined which i absolutely like that you can puff it out and make it bigger but i'm just gonna rock it like this and this is literally just air dried i didn't use my diffuser or anything on it i absolutely love this unit i think it is so cute cute it was very easy to install my baby hairs was giving me a little grief today but hey it is what it is you do not have to use like do baby hairs with this unit but they do pluck it, it already comes pre-plugged so i didn't even bother with plucking it because sometimes i just get over it y'all um they had already bleached the knots that's what it looked like to me so all i did was put foundation on my lace and that was all i did i feel like the density is great i feel like it's very realistic and i really like that and this unit is super deep duper affordable y'all it is really really affordable so make sure you guys check the link in the description box below so you can guys can see how affordable this unit is and if you use my coupon code mona 10 you will get ten dollars off order is over a hundred dollars so make sure you guys use my coupon code but they do offer an array of wigs on their site they have so many options to choose from because i have worked with them in the past so that's why i know this they have so many options guys so many options and uh, so far so good i have yet to review something from them that i just do not like i love the length on this unit i did not cut it or anything y'all i didn't cut this bang this is just how it was laying i just parted it and it just laid how i needed it to do is doing what it needs to do so yes i'm getting ready to go out into the world and slay this bomb unit or whatever i really really like it like i just think it is so cute and it is i feel like the reason why it has great density too because it's not a full lace they do have tracks in the back which i really really like so yes y'all y'all definitely will be seeing me rocking this unit it's absolutely gorgeous it's gorgeous and it does have minimal shedding the shedding isn't too bad or anything like that so yes if you have never heard of my quality hair you should definitely go and check them out because i've worked with them in the past i really like their units and they are on the affordable side so if you're a person that doesn't like to spend a lot of money on wigs this site is definitely going to be for you yes yes so without further ado we're just gonna go ahead and get into the video so this is what your box will look like for my quality hair super cute i love it they insert a slip letting you know what you got a wig cap an elastic band some combs and an edge brush and this is how your wig comes packaged it comes packaged with a hairnet and everything on it which i love i love what companies do that and this is what the wig looks like straight out of the packaging it wasn't hard or anything it was super soft as you guys can see it looks like they already bleached the knots they pre-plugged the hairline and the lace color is brown it has tracks in the back and it has adjustable straps and combs and i did take the combs out but i just wanted to show you guys what the unit looked like straight out of you know the packaging and everything it looked really really good nothing was out of place so i was very impressed with that so you guys already know i like to go ahead and co-wash my units when i get them so i'm just going to co-wash it with some suave conditioner and first i'm going to get it really saturated first you know you want to make sure it's really really wet 
and then I'm gonna apply the suave conditioner and suave conditioner is like one of my favorite conditioners to wash my wigs with because it gives the hair so much slip and is very affordable you guys can see my hands are literally gliding through the hair this hair has so much definition y'all it's like insane I don't think I've ever seen like an afro kinky curly wig with this much definition like the definition is crazy and this is how much shedding I got so not a lot at all so I'm just gonna spray some leave in conditioner and all the products that I use will be in the description box below so I'm just gonna scrunch that into the hair and then I'm going to let the hair air dry overnight and I like to flip my curly hair upside down on a towel and let it dry like this it scrunches the curls and keeps the definition when you let it dry like that so it is the next day as y'all can see I got my gel braids in so I'm just gonna go ahead and put on my wig cap I'm gonna lay down my baby hair so I can get the application process started I removed all of the combs out of the wig and so I'm just going to go ahead and strap up the elastic bands to my liking now this is a cap size small guys so this wig fix my head really really snug which i like because i have a tiny head um so yeah but they do offer different like wig cap sizes and everything so i did go ahead and cut the lace off and now i'm just trying to get the wig situated you know on my head making sure you know it's going to be fitting right around the ear tabs and everything like that so i decided to take some of my foundation and put it on the lace just so that it will blend in with my skin now this step is definitely optional you do not have to like gel your unit down but i'm using the yellow got to be glue gel and i'm just going to lay my unit down because i want it to be super secure you know and then i'm just going to fan the gel until it gets tacky and apply my wig to my liking Then I'm just using my red tail comb to push everything in into place so that it's, you know, nice and secured. <laughs> So once I'm all done, I'm just going to spray some Got To Be Glue Free spray on the perimeter of the lace just to ensure that everything like, you know, stays in place. I'm not no pro at frontals. I just do what I can. <laughs> and then I'm going to tie my hair up with the scarf on for about 15 to 20 minutes. I took the scarf off and then I'm just taking my red silk comb and I'm combing the hair around the perimeter back just to make sure everything is laid down into place. And then I'm going to take some alcohol and clean up the excess spray and gel that was around the hairline. So I'm gonna go ahead and create some baby hairs. Now this step is definitely optional. The wig does come with baby hairs, but I went ahead and cut them a little bit shorter. And then I just used some styling mousse to lay them down. And once I got them to look how I wanted them to be, I did go back and apply a little bit of Eco Styler Gel on top. So I decided to do a deep side part. Y'all know I love a deep side part, so that's what I'm doing here. So I decided to go ahead and put some hair behind my ear and leave out my little sideburn on the side. So that's what I did and I kind of like trimmed it down. So I went ahead and fluffed out the hair a bit with my petal brush just to give it a little bit more volume. And guys, as you wear this hair throughout the day, it can get really big, which I like. And the definition stays, like it doesn't like poof out on you. So this is what the hair looks like from all angles. I love it so much. It is so cute. Y'all have to let me know what y'all think in the comments below. 
but we're not done so this is what the wig looked like the next day guys I wanted to show you how to refresh the hair excuse my lace because I did not tie my hair down properly so my lace did come up but just excuse that just make sure you tie yours down properly so this is just how the hair looked and I'm gonna show you guys how I'm gonna refresh it I'm literally just using a spray bottle of water because you guys remember we had already put leave-in conditioner in the hair so you don't want to keep adding a whole lot of product because it'll just weigh the hair down but as you guys can see just from me spraying the water is literally refreshing the hair and it is bomb y'all this hair is amazing it's super easy to refresh as you guys can see and now we're back in action just like that so i definitely wanted to show you guys this make sure you guys check out myqualityhair.com everything about them will be in the description box below the unit that i'm rocking will be linked in the description box below as well i hope you all enjoyed this video thanks for watching and i will see you all in my next one bye